Um, how do I even start it? That's a good way to start it, me saying, how do I even start it? When you look at other people, you tend to feel like you're less fortunate, forgetting the less fortunate than you. So um, this Christmas time, I just wanted to just put aside myself, not thinking about myself. I haven't bought presents for any of my family, for any of my friends. I don't have a girlfriend. If I had a girlfriend, I, would have, I wouldn't have bought her something either. But I haven't bought anything for anyone. And I've literally just focused on giving back to the homeless and just not only food, drink, and um, other items, but just to share a word of encouragement and just let them know that there's a future out there for everyone and you could always turn it around. And yeah, man, let's turn your candles into chandeliers, boy. Men have it hard out here. Women, they just go, hey. We've got a yard for the night. For real. Cut that out, though. <laughs> Well. This is 75 dollars nothing cheaper than Are you sure? Yeah. What inspired me to do this homeless giveaway this Christmas was based on the first candles into chandeliers we released, that was at the beginning of the year. Um, that one was less about giving and was more of a thought process. So the first candles into chandeliers was me thinking about where I needed to be. Even though by the time I released the second candles into chandeliers, I'm not at the stage I wanted to be, I felt like I should give back and kind of say thanks for what I've achieved and what I've gained already in this journey. Oh, the hands. <laughs> Catching it. <laughs> I will pants to shoot. <laughs> oh, they're actually pants, so. um, so man. Yeah, man. Yeah. A lot of feeling that one in my hands. Chai. You can let a spider man. Size 9s, yeah? Size 9. Bro, you look fresh, man. Females or all good guys. This is going to feel my days. Shout out, God bless the trap. Donating hats, t-shirts, and just scarves to give to the homeless. Much appreciated. Go check them out. God bless the trap London. Sick man, thank you. Everyone's got visions and of where they want to go and where they want to be. But it's like, whilst you're going and whilst you're chasing your dreams, never lose track on what's behind you and who's less fortunate than you and, and always, just always offer a helping hand. So that's what just kind of gave me the, the vision to, you know, give back as well as giving to my future. Cause I've invested so much in what I want to do. So I feel like, you know what, let me invest in others. This is Stephanie. Wow. Oh, Shanika. This is Shanika. <laughs> cut, cut. This is Shanika. She's been so helpful people. Look at everything we've got here. Let's take you through. Shanika, you want to tell them what we've got in there? Me? Okay. Water, um, a sausage roll, a tin of um, soup, crisp, and I made some sandwiches. That's the food stuff. That's the food stuff, okay. And chocolate. You see the um, toiletries here as well. Air freshener, toilet roll, shower gel, toothbrush, paracetamol, shaving cream, crisp, and a snack alongside their clothes. So these are going to be for two people now. We've seen two people in the area. It's going to be also Christmas giving. Giving back to the homeless. Right now we're in New Cross. I don't know if a homeless person. To bless them this Christmas. Let's do it. Nice to meet you. What's your name? Amina. Nice to meet you, Amina. I'm Tops. 
I was I was living in Eighty Street in Deptford. Oh, Deptford, yeah. Yeah, and uh, I was homeless for four years before that. And I was in Deptford for four years to see me. I've got a dog, and uh, the police was the bidding for me that flat. Yeah. And uh, when I got the flat, and uh, for one year, they said to me, if I pass for one year, profession, yeah. then I'm going to keep it. That's the council flat. This is toiletries, okay. so it's got a mixture of uh, paracetamol, shower gel, toothpaste, okay. um, toothbrush. Um, here there's some fruit, okay. there's some bread, there's some drink, there's some soup, there's some crisp, there's some water. In this bag, there's some wipes. Okay. There's also some clothes, some hats, um, a scarf, gloves, trainers, sanitizers. So it's almost like your own Christmas present okay. yeah, from us. He said he doesn't, he doesn't beg, he just kind of has, he sells these ashtrays. I respect that man. Big time. You're getting it how you can. Wow. Yeah. Hey! Hey! Wow. Hey! No! No! Hey! Hey! That's so beautiful. From the second candles into chandeliers, that's, it's more of a thought process for me. It's more of me kind of, uh, a retrospective of me just kind of looking back on a year, looking back on how far I've come, looking back on where I may have fallen short on and where I'd like to go. I was a young nigga trying to grow up too quick. Didn't want to be a man. A lot of people that are standing to me. Let's see if we can find something to help. Let's help us carry the stuff to get it out. Let's say no. Hair on the tortoise. Know where I wanna be, but not my way like a tourist. Spoke to a florist. He said in due time. Even the sea turns to a flower when the time's right. Right? The magic, you know when we were growing up and we are like, oh, the magic of Christmas goes because we get older. No, the magic of Christmas goes because we realise that people are so less fortunate than we are and all we care about is what present we get or like what Christmas dinner we're having or what family we're spending it with when we don't think about the rest of the people who don't have... My money is how to win that girl's heart. Typical nigga shit. Typical. Spend the same amount of time trying to find God. Does that mean me a hypocrite? Because oh, no. I could admit, I ain't no preacher, son. No. I'm saying it's a sinner who got back up. That's why I ain't giving up. Up. Even if the grass ain't green, I shit, I'm a diet. Life's too short to hold grudges. Don't air, he's cool, reply it. But we could toast with champagne. Yeah. If there's no cups, I'm a sky. <laughs> Cause I don't know where them lips spin. But I ain't judging you, girl. Some friends, I guess we lose on purpose. To show us our purpose. Don't worry about what your friend just purchased. Nah, don't worry about that. You can't clean a dirty heart with detergent. No, you can't do that. Keep a clean heart, cause even Eve trusted that sir. I said keep trying till you standing on that podium And let them haters fuel your drive like they're petroleum 
Watching Keenan and Kel on Nickelodeon. You what was a star in the sky, ox the free holy man, Nickel Paul. Turn your candles into Panels into Chandeliers 2 was just kind of like me talking to myself. It was more like a diary and just hoping that someone could listen to it, take from it, and hopefully it could touch someone else and hopefully inspire someone to do bigger things, just like it inspired me. Turn your candles into, turn your candles into, let it shine for the world to see, baby. Raphael, so. <laughs> Thank you.